Hey. Hello. Hello. How are you? How are you guys? <laughs> That's Good. It's a big step up to come down. <laughs> Travis and Kaylee came to me. They were like, bless son. We took on this project about a year ago, got one level done, and now we have no idea what to do with the rest. What was this before? Uh, well, it's all the same layout. It was just cosmetic. So okay. new counters, new cabinets. cabinets. We just love the fact that we could expose the brick. This is very cool. Yeah. We kind of knew right from the get-go that we wanted to renovate the house. Didn't know exactly all that was involved. We're first time home buyers. We love the location. It was a great price point and great square footage, but it needed a lot of work. And then Sully yeah, came along. Sully came along. <laughs> And our newborn who's six weeks old. That's one component, right? Like I just don't yeah, have time. Need to help. All right, well, I'm gonna see the upstairs. Yeah, you have to see it for yourself. It's a sure. weird problem to have to say you have too much square footage. Yeah, they've got tons of space. That's not the problem. It's how does that space get configured? You seeing what they did with the first level is good. They look how big. That's what we mean. Like, it's enough space, but it's just not thought through. Once those second, third floors get done, it can't be detached from what they did on the first floor. You only have the two windows in here. I mean, they're big. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get so much beautiful natural light. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is going to be the TV wall, right? Right. Let's ship this fireplace over. We'll add a mantle so it's a real focal point and not on that weird angle. We'll have built-in shelving going up the stairs to give it a real custom look and keep the eye going up. That sounds yeah. amazing. Yeah. But then what does this become? Because this space is so big, we were thinking at least just because if we're gonna put any potential kiddos upstairs, that the main bedroom could actually eat up some of this extra space. So this would become the main? Yes. This is big. This is plenty of room right here for a bedroom. Right. So then this guest bathroom becomes part of the main. Yep. I like it a lot. Yeah. Second floor is gonna be a main bedroom, ensuite, big closet, fireplace, built-ins, hopefully like a little dry bar. There's a lot, but you do have a lot of room to play yeah. with. Yeah. This third floor is the most unique by far. <laughs> All right, so going into our main, right off the bat, you have our laundry. Very tight. Okay, so this is a full bath. What is this? That used to be a really old jacuzzi tub. And now and it's just a shoe platform? It's a yes. shoe platform. Did you do it? Yeah. It was so gross. We couldn't live with the bathtub. And then you said, screw it, we're gonna yeah, make a we shoe like holder. Very creative. Okay, this is a big room. It's a big main. It doesn't make sense anymore. The main would be downstairs. Yep. We could split this bedroom in half, so we'll get a total of three bedrooms. One would be an office, then two bathrooms, a laundry room, and a kitchenette, so you won't have to go all the way downstairs. Can we talk about outdoor space? Basically, we're in love with the fact that we have this space, but we're not in love with any particular yeah, yeah, yeah. aspect of the space. Are you in love with this? <laughs> no. no. So this can be power washed and like yes. completely repainted. Yep. Yes. If you're doing all this inside, yeah. I don't care if you're on the back side. This is your curb appeal. And it right. definitely needs some TLC, yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Design-wise, I really want to know, what do you want to see? Mid-century modern plus some Moroccan flair. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Moroccan mid-century is a very weird, cool vibe, but there's a way to do it. Okay. How do we just make that whole thing feel good and make you guys feel good while you're here? Yeah. And now we need to talk budget. I mean, so the budget is 175. And okay. we know that that's pretty, like, Modest, but at the same time, it's it's like two floors. So now you're looking at framing, electrical, plumbing, a main bathroom, and then two additional bathrooms. So what's your real number? <laughs> uh, 175. <laughs> you. Not a lot's been going on. We've just been waiting for permits. We're starting to demo anything that we can, but at this point, we're just in a holding pattern. So today, Christy and I are gonna go meet with Jorge, who is the GC over at Southport. Homeowners are in Florida. Like, they just didn't want to be around any, like, dust or anything. Little did they know they could have sat still for another, like, two months. There's zero visual appeal here. It's just falling apart. Can we paint these? We can work with that. I, I mean, think we mainly can. Mainly, you're thinking of, like, doing some white. 
With some I would do those in black, in black so... do the door in black, all the trim in black, and then the whole house white. Yeah. Other than that, yeah. we need another exit out from the second level. So not from this one, from this level. He was saying from the second level, yeah. The bad news is that while I'm walking with Jorge, he's telling me that they now have to have a second egress from the second floor. The crew is framing and doing minor work while the architect's still trying to figure that second exit out. And obviously now this is a huge concern with this second egress and what that's gonna ultimately do for the budget. I don't know. Meanwhile, I just need to find the pieces that make this project really special and get everyone excited again. Southport just didn't have the spark. I'm not gonna lie, I just haven't been overly excited about it. So it's time to start shopping. I am out in the burbs with Christy, and I mean like the burbs. We're in Aurora, we're at Warehouse 55, exploring and imagineering. Ooh, look at this, look how weird. $79. I always wanted to ride horses. I really mean it when I say that one of my favorite things in life is antiquing. She wants this vibe of like Moroccan and mid-century and like the whole deal. Oh my God. You know I love these. Yeah. The fact that it's like, you know, imperfect. I have an opportunity to do beautiful French doors from the main bedroom into the bathroom. Yeah. These are like, Perfect. And the scale of them, I think, is what's really kind of great about it. Agreed. Hey, Mark, I'm in love with these. Yes. What is the backside? Like, is it the same? Is it just as pretty? <gasps> Gorgeous. Oh. Yes. Yes. They're so beautiful. Today, I'm finally seeing Kaylee and Travis. They have relocated to Florida while the house is getting done. They've now been there way too long. The last time we were here, you guys weren't here, and Jorge and I and Christy, we were talking about your issue mm -hmm. with yeah. the second egress. Yep. You're gonna have massive problems. <laughs> you know, to hear today from Travis, he's super frustrated. I know he's hiding it with a smile. I'd be pissed too. Now it's 30 grand just to get you out the door. Small little landing, stairs down. That's what's required to even get this project moving. Uh. That bad news, we're hopefully gonna offset it with some good news. Mm -hmm. The exterior was a big thing for me. We envisioned it white with these black windows and the door and some planters. They with the style, the Moroccan, mm -hmm. and then you also like mid-century, and that's actually two things I've never been able to mix yes. before. Super so I, weird. Super <laughs> weird, but like, we'll figure it out. Yeah. But the whole vibe here was this tile that we were gonna have mm. up and around. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. And then truly just do a big chunky wood mantle. We really want to do these really cool built-ins. Yeah. Up the stairs. Yeah. With then this tile just here. I think it like kind of goes with like a warmth vibe too. Mm-hmm. It's actually kind of cool to see it all laid out. Yeah, let's all stand up. <laughs> <laughs> God, that hurt. Who's got a laser? Someone here has a laser pointer. Yes! There you go. <laughs> so here, <laughs> in the main bath, you got this beautiful vanity right here. And then to the left, where your tub is, that's gonna have that window wall. We found this old window. Yeah. So this would be stained glass, illuminated behind. We've done it before, it looks so beautiful. Now we don't have to do tile on that wall. So that just yeah. becomes this really cool moment when you're taking a bath. Yeah, that sounds very spa-like. It is. See, it made the trip worth it. Yeah. yeah. Awesome, awesome. Budget by the end of the week. Yep, scout's on her. Oh, good. Is he a scout? No. no. He, wi he wishes he was a scout. Well, then I don't believe you. Okay, cool. The elephant in the room has a price tag on it now. $30,000, now where do we go from here? It's been 11 months since we started Southport. Hey, you're doing good. And we're finally seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. The luxury vinyls being installed. That beautiful vertical stack tile in the bathroom is going up. And the fireplace surround is finally getting framed out. Oh God, that's terrible. This would make me so depressed. <clears throat> Just to take away my shock and disappointment from the exterior, inside is just so much happier. 
You know, it feels good. Jorge couldn't make it. Joey's here just to help me out with some answers. Hi, Joey. How's it going? What's up? Good to see you. Good to see you. Everything's under control. Ah, so mantle. Yep. All right, so this is getting cut down. Yep. That's gonna go here. We have tile tiles here? It's on the way. Okay. I mean, we're close. Yeah. All right, let's go see the bath. The bathroom's right. I saw the window, too. This is gonna be amazing. We have a, a slight issue. Okay. The LED light yes. is super concentrated in one area. Ah, so we're gonna we take need to flood. Yeah. So I think we're gonna run a strip. Yeah, you an should. LED strip. Oh, God, yeah. Do you want us to hold this up on the Hell light? Oh, yeah. Let's do it. You think this is gonna be concentrated? This is version one. Yeah. What That's is this? This is version oh, one. Out. This version is <laughs> Rome wasn't built in a day. When Joey told me like, you know, the, the light's a little concentrated in one area, you'll, you'll see. You think? Let there be light. It's a little concentrate. Look, come here. It's a little concentrated it's gonna in one be area. You, you've got a spotlight behind it. So yeah, we'll do strip lighting. All right. And then that'll illuminate beautifully. And it's gotta be something that they can dim. You know, you don't want it to be, you don't want it That's to be hot. That's a good hot. point. Hey, are we doing a jam or are we doing barn doors? It should be barn yeah. doors. It is on a crack. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, this is cool. We're gonna keep the hardware on them, just yep. as is. Yeah. Yep. Tub yeah. goes in, and then we're bringing furniture in. Just gotta let these guys get to work. I know, I know. <laughs> but that bathroom, that's a showstopper moment right there. It's just beautiful, it's like you don't know where to look. Next stage is furniture, and then get them into their house. I feel so bad, this entire process has been so grueling for them, and I'm sure they're just at the end of their rope. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs>I mean, I've been through it. I've been in your shoes. I know I can fully, fully feel your pain every time your heart broke. It was brutal. It yeah. was brutal. But, but we're here. Like, it's not bad. It's not bad. No. And I think it complements, too, the balcony up top. Yeah. We ended up with this wonderful deck to sit yes. out at. Yes. I mean, the backyard yeah. needed love anyway. We're going to walk upstairs and it's going to be real show. All right. Yeah. Okay. Can't wait. Let's go. I don't know when I started doing this eyes closed thing, but I like it. Okay. I remember how long you lived away from it. Your kid is 15 now. <laughs> Driving. Driving, going to college. Okay, open your eyes. Oh, oh wow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this does not He's look like our house. Me. No, it doesn't look like our house at all. Wow. <laughs> No, Perfect. this is what a living room should be. Oh my gosh, the fireplace. I mean, that tile. Come on. Oh my yes. gosh. Moroccan. Yes. Unbelievable. <laughs> yes. We did it. Let's go to the bedroom. Come on. This is really cool. All right, so bedroom. Awesome. Love it. Oh my gosh. And yes. so taking more of that space, right? And like bringing the closet to this area. This is a king bed. This right. feels good. You Everything know? about this is good space. I love it. And come on, please. <laughs> Putting it on the barn track allows us to always stare at these. Well, you and know, it feels taller. It feels way yes. taller. Yeah. Are you guys ready? Yes. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like a spa. Yeah. That's what it is. It is like a Moroccan spa. Yeah. You didn't have a window in here, which made it feel really dark. So finding this window makes it feel like we're dealing with a sunny day and at least you got something coming in. Right. Yeah. And look at them. It makes this feel so regal. It feels very luxurious. It is like a bathhouse. Gorgeous, and you have a full tub in here. Yeah, I love the tile. Yeah, me too. And there's not a whole lot of mid-century in here. I wanted this to be <laughs> yeah. full Moroccan. Yes. And this just... is mine. I mean, you get the shower. I love that you get to come up to this. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at it. Oh, it's so cool. So we've got the beautiful little spigot here. The appliances you wanted and needed, it all fit in here. Yeah, yes. it was amazing. That was a feat. There's certainly a lot of quirks about this house, and one of them is that the kitchen is all the way on the first floor. Yeah, <laughs> so it's this a is... lot, but now you've made it to where yeah. you don't have to go down there all yes. the time.
this is definitely a value yeah. add. All right, come on. Remember this quirky room here? This feels like a real office. This is, this is awesome. This is swanky. This is swanky very cool. Is right. It's amazing to think that this was half of the main bedroom. Yeah. Yeah. And we've got Sully's room. Yay. So like, look how much room you have. Oh, yeah, so it looks fun. so bright too. Oh, it is, yeah. Yeah, it's perfect. It is. It's such a better use of space. Yeah. Mm -hmm.